Yes, lads, Joe Bleen here, and today I've got a 70k, 65k, it's dropping lots to the market, crash at the moment because of the team of season, which is coming out, but well, it's already going to be out by the time you see this video. But yeah, let's jump into it, and I'll show you, in goal we've got Rolf Farham, he's definitely my favourite silver keeper at the moment, probably, he's overtaking Mula for me, especially for Bundesliga, and I use him when I can. We've then got Dennis Dijkmaier, who's a really, really strong, fast right back, he goes up and down that pitch and he's worth the coins. We've then got Kirchhoff, he's probably my favourite centre-back for the Bundesliga Germans and I just love him he's really good and obviously he's got that perfect link with form and as well in 6 up 5 then got Felipe from Hanover who's really good you could also go for Emerson in Serie A depending on who you prefer out of him I like Felipe because he's a bit taller and stronger whereas Emerson's a bit more of a ball player so it all depends which mix you want to go for because he is there who you could also use in this squad at left back we've then got Rafa Martino he's mainly just pace if I'm honest but he is also pretty decent, and his pace alone allows him to be able to defend along with being six or decent with three stars, going with a four star weak foot when he can cross with him too. Then got Wilfred Zaha, who I wanted to try out because normally I go for like Redmond this year and the right mid, but yeah, I thought I'd try out Zaha, and he's actually pretty decent to his job, although he didn't actually score for me, he just contributed with like the general play of things. Then got Fabian Dolph in the middle, who's really good, along with Ibsen, who's one of my favourite players as well. Then got Juan Emmanuel Iturbe, and that scores some absolute crackers of whom you're going to see in the highlights. And they're the only two, but they're absolute crackers. He's also really good overall. And then we've got Gabriel Bongleho, who's an absolute god, and that Moscadelli, my god. And as you can see here, this is the one that I had to buy on the account after I got reset, which I picked up for 300 coins, but obviously goes for quite a bit more than that now. But this is the squad, lads. Obviously, we'll go jump into the gameplay now and carry on talking about it more. So I'll meet you back there. So with this squad, I wouldn't necessarily say it contains players that as such are hidden or anything. I'd say all these players I use in this team are players that you've definitely seen me use before. I don't think there's... I think Zahar's the only player I haven't used before in this team because I normally go for other options. And he was pretty decent. I think for the coins, Redmond's actually a bit better to say he's only like a couple, like 1, 2k and Zahar's like the 10, 11, 12k. But Zahar is, I don't know actually, I think they're very, very similar. Zahar might be a little bit stronger than Redmond. But it all, all depends if the coins you've got on preference at the end of the day, I guess. Obviously, I think in this role, I wanted to let Moscow take a more reserved role. So I was practicing with the other people and just letting Moscadelli be that like target man holder upper in this team while like, Bongo obviously did the running onto the free ball to strike away. Turby played a brilliant role as always, Ibsen as well, and Delph playing that commanding role. And it's just a very solid squad. Once again, a team where there's nobody in there for the sake of it. Everybody's in there and they deserve to be in there just as much as everyone else. So this is a pretty nice squad and I do recommend you trying it out and making it because it it's also interchangeable if you have a look at it, how the chemistry lines work. It's a pretty simple hybrid to make in terms of it. And obviously, as I said, you can swap between Emerson and Felipe. And a lot of the other players, there's all options. Like I said earlier, Redmond for Zaha, any Italian Serie A striker, um, any, well, you can swap them around. It's all easy to make, lads, but I do hope you enjoyed it. If you did like it, leave a like, of course. If you're new here, subscribe. Come follow me on Twitter, at HD, and I'll see you all later.